Alright guys, CR1000 here. I got these teeth in, and we'll get to that in a minute. But today, I'm, we're going to put this muffler onto that 1973 Briggs & Stratton Edger. Stay tuned. Okay guys, I got to wear these teeth because Monkey and I made a bet whether she was going to sell that, that little knob and it was going to be a clown nose, but the clown nose wasn't any good so we got these teeth. So that was the bet. She sold the knob today to a guy named Steve. Steve. Thanks, Steve. So we told him the story. Oh, he had to buy it. So he's going to watch this video just to see me wear these teeth. So, again, thanks, Steve. Hell of a nice guy, though. But anyhow, so let's get this put on to the uh the edger okay hang tight and i'll be right with you all right guys it, here's the old muffler there's not much left of it a lot of that heat will come over here to the carburetor and it'll want a vapor lock but let's go ahead and start it up so we can hear the difference Okay, I never did adjust that carburetor. So, let's go ahead and take this old muffler off. Now that it's nice and hot. Okay, so there's these little tabs right here. Uh, let me zoom in. little tabs right here just going to want to get on one of them and give it a quick tap but not real hard this is aluminum and this is steel so you got to be careful especially when they've been in here this long there it is okay so now we can unscrew this like this sometimes they're really hard to get out but this one was pretty easy and the one I took out of the other motor over there it was actually pretty easy too it was a little harder than this one but it wasn't bad so let me get you back out here so you can get the idea Okay, so, there's that. Get that out of the way. Then we'll put the air cleaner back on. And we'll see if it needs adjusted again. Sometimes you got to readjust them after you put the air cleaner on, but we'll just have to see. So we're going to screw this back on here.
just like that. Now, we're just going to take these and tap it the other way. And that's good enough. It don't have to be super done or walking tight. Okay, so let's put this on. Uh, I'm going to put our little deal here on. goes like this all right now tighten this up there you go all right now, okay. Now let's start this thing up again and see what it sounds like. Whoops. guys so that's why I got the teeth in I lost the bet but actually I'm the one that kind of told the story to help monkey out but I didn't think the guy would buy it but Steve bought it so there you guys go my debt is paid <laughs> anyway thanks for watching guys remember Shea Bear the myth the man the legend I'm gone for now Bye-bye, guys. Take care.